Watch going on guys. My brain is fried. I'm gonna be honest. Um Yeah, so I didn't have any short days in class today. They all went their full time. So I have sat in nine hours of classes today. Me, 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 me. My brain it's bad because the last class is math, so it's like, okay, here's some new stuff. You go ahead and learn this while your brain is saying, no, no more. No, no more. That's that's enough information. Stop. Stop it. And then I said, nope, you got to add a little more. And it's like, no, no. It's like when you're eating and you got to stop eating. It's kind of like brain information. You know, you're like, okay, I'm pushing that a little too much. Sorry. Um, today was a grand day for the challenge. Everything went well. Uh, woke up good. Exercised. Uh, what did I do this morning? Oh, man, I gotta run tomorrow, because I didn't run today. <sighs> Chloe, what do you think about that? It kind of stinks, huh? So, I didn't run today, but I did work out. Got my tracked out. Actually, forgot a track, but found one in the car. I was like, woo, thank you. Um, medium. Let's see, what else do I have? John 1836. You know, I don't know that verse, but what I wrote down was, it's a good reminder, and it's good to know that the Lord's kingdom is not of this world. Basically, I think the verse said, um, sorry, it's not on my face. Basically, the verse said, uh, oh, he was talking to Pilate? Was he talking to Pilate? I think, I believe Jesus was talking to Pilate. And he said, um, my, basically, he said, my kingdom is not of this world. Don't look at the mess behind me, sorry. That's just my towel. Let it dry there. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, we have a new verse today. Uh, and the things that thou hast heard of, of me among many witnesses, of me? I think it's of me. Among many witnesses, the same commit thou to faithful men who shall be able to teach others also. I believe that's correct. That is 2 Timothy 2.2. 2. And, okay. and the things... That thou hast heard of me among many witnesses, the same commit thou to faithful men, who shall be able to teach others also. I keep wanting to say that they, but um, that's a good verse. If, sometimes you memorize a verse and you just go, yay, I got the words all correct. But you don't think about the saying. Or you don't think about the verse. You don't think about what it means. So that helped me to memorize it. Um... Basically, Paul was writing to Timothy, saying, uh, the things that you heard about me, commit to faithful men, so they can teach others about what I do and what the, the Christian life is all about. So that's basically what he was saying. And Agrippa is out, and he's hungry. I just know it, because I haven't fed him in a week. He's fasting for the whole week, you know. No, I'm just kidding. I'm going to feed him tonight. Um, Chloe, get out of my drawers. Go. Shoo. Maybe I should close my drawer. That's probably a good idea. There we go. Now she won't get in. Yeah, I'm a slob. Sorry. I was born in a barn. Not really. Just kidding. Um, let's see if I can do the verses. I haven't looked at uh, Ephesians 6, 11 through 18. Let's see if I can do it. Put on the whole armor of God that she may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore take unto you, wherefore take unto you the whole armor of God, that she may be able to withstand in the evil day, and having done all to stand. Stand therefore with her loins girt about with truth. Have, stand therefore having your loins girt about with truth, and having on the breastplate of righteousness and your feet shod with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Above all, taking the shield of faith, wherewith ye shall be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked, and take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the Spirit, which is the word of God. Someday I'm going to bring my... I haven't finished that, I know. I'm going to bring my Bible and look at it after every verse to make sure I said it right. Now where was I? I shouldn't have interrupted myself. Uh, praying always with all prayer and supplication in the spirit and watching 
and watching thereunto with all thereunto and watching thereunto with all perseverance and supplication for all saints. I believe I got that correctly. You can correct me in the comments below if you'd like. So, uh, let me... I know it's not... Let's see. So, tomorrow... Today and tomorrow, 2 Timothy 2.2. 2, um, I want to go over my personal challenges real quick. Have I been doing these things? Oh, that's what I have not been doing. Because I left my Bible at church, I don't know where my prayer list is. I mean, it's in it's in my Bible. And I can't find one. I should ask my parents. But I need to pray for the whole thing tomorrow. Except the front front cover I prayed for. But after that, I haven't been praying for the list. So I need to pray for that whole thing tomorrow. Which I will. Um, follow my schedule. I've been doing decent at that. I'm not going to lie. There are times that I go off of my schedule. But the days I do, it's because I know I can because of school. Like tomorrow, I can't go off my schedule. Because, um, basically I'm done with everything at 8.30, because 8.30 is breakfast. So, you know, I'll eat breakfast somewhere before then. Because sometimes I don't shower the whole time that I have scheduled, and I don't exercise the whole time I have scheduled. So that works well. I have been doing a YouTube fast. Um, I've been watching Adam's videos, and that's it. I've caught myself several times clicking on a YouTube video on Facebook because someone says it's funny or whatever. And I'm like, oh, I can't do that. Um, you know, I haven't been praying out loud for devotions. I need to get back to doing that. I'm glad I looked at this. Uh, read missionary letters every week. I haven't been doing that either. Do I have them? You know what? They're in my Bible. No, they're right here. I should do that tomorrow as well. No, that's last week's. Oh, here it is. Okay, this is the big packet that we got from Pastor. So I'll read. Since we probably won't have any new ones tomorrow, because it seemed like they come every two weeks. I could be wrong, but I should be able to read through these tomorrow sometime. I have a class in the morning, so honestly, I think to myself that I have to do all these things in the morning during my devotions, which I really don't. What did I do with Chloe, what did I do with that? I just had something, and now we covered it up. There it is. All right. So, yeah, I need to read those. Uh, vlog every day. I have been vlogging every day. I have not missed a single day, which is good. No eating after 8. I've been doing fine on that. Unless there's some special activity or outing. Which, sat this Saturday might be one of those exceptions, but I'm not sure. No Facebook before 9 a.m. Been doing fine with that. No big deal. So, pretty good so far. Not too bad. Um, but yeah, I need to work on... Get back to praying out loud for devotions. I think in the morning, like, it helps me wake up to talk. But, because I'm tired, I don't want to talk. And sometimes I'll, like, just mouth it. I guess I could do that. That would help me wake up, too, but... Anyway... This is a long vlog. Sorry, guys. Um, ums. I will let you go. I need to feed this little dude. We need to clean out his tank, too. Yuck. That's disgusting. All right, guys. We will see you tomorrow. Have a good night. Um, I'll stop it right at nine nine minutes. So I got five seconds to say a couple things. Um, uh, um, uh, bye.